Hi, this is my first product review and it's going to be on the Saigo Light Metro 400 meaning that this thing goes up to 400 lumen sprites. It's a uh, really well designed headlight. It feels very sturdy. I really like the uh, rubber on off button that they have here. It's a uh, USB rechargeable with a built in lithium ion battery. Here's the charging port cover right there. This has about uh, six modes on it and also includes a special walk mode which means it goes pretty dim, a little bit less than low. I'll just uh, cycle through for you here. I'll show you the effect on the ground. This is high, medium, low. And this mode right here is what's called steady pulse. Uh, it's basically the, the light is on steady but it's uh, overlapped by triple pulses right there. Next one is day lightning mode. This is uh, this is a boosted lumens mode, um, only to be used during the daytime, and it's uh, very very bright. You will be noticed with it. Turn off. We just press and hold. Real quick about the light. Uh, it weighs 100, 110 grams. Charge time is about five hours, and on high it will last an hour and 45 minutes. And in the special walk mode, it will last for about 150 hours at least, according to a uh, Cygo light. I'm going to show you the light here straight on or at least angled off so it doesn't blind you too much. Again, this is high, medium, low. The steady pulse feature here. And the day lightning mode. And it's back to high. Now, to get to the walk mode, what you have to do is turn it off first. And then while it's off, simply press and hold the button about two seconds and now it's in walk mode. Uh, this feature is only available on the Saigo Light Metro Light. Now this is the main headlight I use on my commuter bike. Uh, it is a really good light. It does advertise supposedly side ports on on the side here but um, even in the dark you really cannot see it out of the side ports too well. Another thing uh, I'm not I don't really like too much about this light is that um, it is kind of more of a spotlight deal. Uh, it does not actually spread the light out too too good, at least not to my liking. It is very uh, very spotlight like. So if you're looking for some kind of like a flood type light, uh, this wouldn't quite be the one. But other than that, though, it has been a really good light. Uh, I like all the uh, functions and features about it. Um, it's given me no issues at all. Uh, I have actually been caught in a rainstorm with it, and it seems to be just about waterproof because it got completely soaked and it works just fine so anyway that's that's the uh, Cycle Light Metro 400 hope you enjoy thanks